Hello everybody, welcome back to another uh, City Skylands episode. Now today we're actually going to work on Hilltop. Which will be this nice new district up here. With uh, high density, high rise ban, international themed and everything. I mean, I wouldn't make this area be a nice big grid, but it's a little bit of an impossibility with its shape, or because of its shape. I will keep this perfectly level though, just right by the highway. get a nice hilltop central station and we'll more than likely just uh, I get across just like that I mean, that'll probably actually... I stand there and split off into about a million roads. Boom, massive intersection. Right, so this will just come down the entire way. Right then eight and then it'll just come in like that. That one will go around like that. That one will just go around like that, this one like this. So this will be the awkward, windy, mountainous road. Right. 
Right, so there we go. A lot of nice roads everywhere. So this road actually goes on over to the beach, just like all the other road, or just like, well, this road also goes down to the beach. These two roads curve round, that one goes up there. Right, so that'll be a uh, four lane up to there. Alright, so there we go. Right, so there we go. Right, so there we go, and uh, park-wise, there are no parks anywhere near here. Which is uh, spectacular. Nice tropical garden. I'm gonna get a nice Japanese garden out this way with uh, Doge Park. Nice basketball kind of stuff. Tennis as well. Right, so this will be hillside, it'll be all residential. 
High density residential to be exact. I mean, there are no parks right this way. And we'll work on that. And uh, services in general, we'll work on that as well. Hold up, wait. High rise ban is absolutely quite a bit necessary. Policy city planning high rise ban. Now, this area might not have gotten a high rise ban if it weren't for the uh, for the airport, which is right next door. And by right next door, I mean the airport's right there. I'll give these guys one of these, whatever this is. I'm going to also hope that they get better. Nice long road down the bottom. Absolutely uninterrupted road too. There we go, now it is interrupted. Once. Okay, themes, it'll be uh, themed international. There shall be another train station, just a regular one actually. I mean something like that and that'll be good enough what the hell was that? it just wouldn't allow me to do that but I guess that's fine Right, gonna get the thing out there then. Anyway. I think that this will cause a lot of people to move in. Gonna be completely honest. A lot of people will move in as a result of this and uh, come to work. A 
over in the factories just near here. I mean, fair enough, there are a few offices and commercial buildings and stuff like that, but... Not many. And seeing how huge Hilltop is, there shouldn't be any kind of problem whatsoever getting. All sorts of uh, people living out here. Right, so that went goes around like that. And this area up here will just be connected via a bus line. Now this will be connected directly via a metro all the way to the uh, leisure district. If I'm correct, uh, very close to the airport. All by metro. And to be honest, the only reason why this area even has metros is because that one, uh, because the airport has a metro. Sorry, because that train station has a metro thing, like, attached to it. So, you know what, we might as well use it. Right then, so what is that line? That is metro line number 6. Which needs about doubled. We've actually more than doubled it, but um, this area... Schooling would probably be a nice privilege to get out here. Now there we go, get a couple of nice little schools in here. Alright, get one over there, get one over there, get one over there. Get one over there. There's a lot of crosswalks on this road. As it is a long stretch of road without any crossroads on it. Nah, I mean that spot's fine, there's one that could go over there. I mean, come on, what the hell is that? Alright, so this place is growing. This area is complaining less about workers. This area is still complaining fully. How about this area up here? 
and the entire thing was just complaints. Yeah, I mean, they are clearly taking up these jobs, and there's less uh, icons flashing over here, so hopefully they will move on eventually and go work in other places as well. Then again, a lot of these places are still level 1 and whatnot. Fair enough, these guys have no education whatsoever. Just one elementary school will do that. Because it's better than nothing. Now, I mean, it doesn't have to go all the way out over there, it can just come back down this way. Fair enough, I mean, we can stop down there. How is traffic? It's at 62%. What the hell went wrong? Okay, it's this highway. Which is all clogged up because of this. You see what freaking idiots this city has. You see this? This right here single handedly has caused the entire freaking city to demolish itself traffic wise. One stupid little uh, intersection. My good lord. Just go into the closest lane and don't block other traffic. What are these idiots doing? Just go! What utter, utter idiots. You don't deserve to drive. All of you should have your license revoked, and you should never be able to get it back, like ever. Now, this area only has a few worker issues. This area has quite a few, but it's getting better over here as well. And this area, even though it doesn't look like it, there are a lot. A hillside residence. Well, you actually live in Hilltop. That's Hillside. There's 10,000 people in Hillside. Hilltop has 9,600.
It's a lot of Euro buildings over here. It should rectify itself eventually. Yeah, I mean, it's an international theme. Now, how many trains on this line? There's three, so four, five, six. Double, a little over double. So seven would be a good number, I think. A few people are using the station, which is nice to see. And quite a few people using this one as well. Right, um, actually, that's the cherry line, and that's the, uh, the hilltop or hillside line on them. So, no, that one's the, uh, the hillside line, and this one's a hilltop line. So, change it so that this is hillside and this is cherry. This industrial district's cherry. Not enough educated workers over there in the industrial. So yeah, I mean, my, my turnaround plan worked absolutely brilliantly. So you can see there's only a few not enough worker problems, there's several not enough customer problems. Which is actually none of my problem, because they are... General residential, okay. Even though that is tourism. So, basically what they need is more tourists, but I don't know how to deal with that, okay. There's a massive intersection here, has traffic lights, so we're just going to get rid of those. I mean, look at that intersection, it is crazy. Biggest attraction here in Hilltop, just the way people handle that damn intersection. Alright, just uh, send it round like that. And then uh, we'll actually come right here. There's no need to go down that way twice, so we won't. this bus will now go this way oh I forgot that this road existed ok so we'll go in like this we'll stop there and then we'll complete the line ok so this one I'll have the LFAs, we'll get I think about 15 I'll get 13. So this is a pretty long and fairly weird line. Why the hell are the bleeding traffic lights at every intersection? Thought I got rid of them. And I get to see that this is being used. A lot of people waiting. And a lot of people just came out, and a lot of people are just now going down in there and whatnot. It's good to see that that hasn't backed up all through the tunnel again. Now, these are pretty backed up. I 
I mean, this is a pretty major area over here with several, several connections to different highways and roads and stuff. And again, so is this area. And then this area will be as well. And here I was like, I wonder what the quickest route to, say, San Federica is. It's down this way. We'll exit onto the main uh, road there. Or you exit down this way. You come down this way. What I'm going to do here is actually disable right hand turns so you can't actually go that way. So you're forced to go down the main road. Because at this point it isn't quicker anymore to do that, it is just quicker to just go down this way. I think the worker dilemma has been completely solved. Not an issue over there, not an issue over here. Okay, it's over here. Not an issue over here. Look at that. Now there's just a customer issue. Now the worker issue has been solved. Now there's a customer issue. And now I think that we may ha might have too many workers in the workforce. And we're importing a lot of oil again. We're exporting a lot of goods. Goods has become a main export. Not that much liquid gold, actually. <laughs> Only a few agricultural guys exporting. I mean, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. I'd much rather them keep it within the city rather than export it out and import more stuff I mean and so we export just a ton of goods a lot of goods exports comes from, come from here which means that this was a successful mission to get this thing over here And we drilled costs way down with the amount of industrial we got. And now we do have quite a few trash problems throughout this area. So what we could do is actually just drill a few industrial buildings to the ground and have them collect garbage instead. And crematorium issues are a different matter. Do not want anybody living next to a crematorium because that would just be depressing? So that would be depressing as hell. Where the hell are the buses? No left turns, only right and forward. Oh wait, there are buses up here. Let's go on a trip with this guy. And all the buses are still coming over here or are very new over here. Okay, so I just picked up almost every single passenger, which is a good thing to see, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, not a lot of people would get off at that stop like that, just right around the corner from the train station. 
It's stop minus 11 plus 11. I'm trying to think of a stop that would have a lot of people getting off at. That was one of them. 22 people got off there. How about this one? Five, so not many people get off here. I don't want to ride on that thing for much longer. I'm getting tired already. Anyway. I think now we have actually, a d yeah, we have a pretty high unemployment rate. We only have 300 jobs that are not taken. But once again, we've overcompensated with what we've done. So now we have a high unemployment rate. Which makes me want to look for natural resources. Also known as oil. Because the damn oil area is not doing well. We're importing a lot of oil. Actually, I don't think we even have any more oil anywhere. Oh wow, this is all ore. Let's just pretend like we mined all that out. I don't know why this area would have oil. Just pretend like it did. Holy crap, just uh, so much oil. So many untapped oil reserves out here. Right, so there we go. Right then, so there we go. And uh, just uh, just gonna get quite a bit of raids out here, quite a few raids out here. Well, I mean, what else do you want me to do? It's oil mania out here. Getting as much zoning as possible is the most logical thing to do. Oh, damn.
And that train got extremely confused. Right there. I mean, it was kind of my fault, but not necessarily. Yeah, that's actually the perfect spot for four lanes. Right, so there we go. And then we also have this regional line. Right, so there we go. Out here as well. Nice oil area. I mean, this may screw our city yet again, but screw that if it does. It's fine if it. If I, like I, I, I honestly don't care if it does. If it does, we're gonna build the downtown soon. It's probably gonna help at least a little bit. This is gonna be the first properly non-high-rise ban area of high density that we'll get. Some kind of fire brigade would also be nice. The coppers would also be a nice thing to get out here. Ah, the coppers. Good old coppers. So this will probably be the only area on the planet where there will be three train stations. Yes, three passenger train stations in this area. Could it just morph into a tunnel? 
Actually, you know what? No, I want this. Just go into a tunnel. As quickly as possible. Oh, damn it, it's all the way over there, for God's sakes. For damn sakes! Freaking hate this. Stupid thing. Stupid, stupid. It is negative seven, the forge. I'm gonna freaking kill it when I see it. I honestly will. Like, what the hell is that? Like, seriously. This, I like the station all, but it has to be the glitchiest thing ever. Like, honestly. For crying out loud. Oh yeah, here we go. Same thing. Same freaking thing. Pisses me off every single freaking time. At least this one isn't as freaking notice. <sighs> stupid, stupid. Honest to God, what the hell even is this planet anymore? Now the problem's over here for crying out loud. Stupid thing, I feel like I want to strangle this thing. Damn it, I forgot that this train line existed. Move, stop. Just move it down to here. It's like the flipping game new. It's probably because it did, but that I was gonna build freaking industrial out here, so I put a damn thing just right there. Yeah, I will make that be part of that district. We still import tons of water. Well, actually, gotta let that settle in. A bit more, but once those guys, but once these guys start fully producing oil, there should be almost no imports whatsoever. I knew that would speed them up and that would get them to go over there. Right, so there we go, now we have oil on all sides there in Walnut Square.
garbage is piling up in the met uh, up in the metro station, which is great. Twenty nine thousand people live here. It's causing massive amounts of traffic chaos. Yeah, I thought that this freaking thing would be clogged because of their freaking idiots. I want to kill them all. This lane is solely for turning. No, you imbeciles! In no way are you allowed to merge there. Or there, you have to pick much... Well, actually, no. I'll let them merge there. What idiots! Honestly, just go in the damn lane that you're in. One goes snow. So one goes solely right, the other one goes solely left. Now there you go, now you cut a huge portion of that off. Now you see, use the damn tunnel and use this. What a bunch of retards, like honest to god, what the hell are they doing? Idiots, all of them. Anyway, I'm going to end this episode here guys, so thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys next one, and goodbye.